Hello, hello, welcome to Real Mother's Talk. Another week, another video. My name is Petra. So today I will talk about a subject that three years ago I couldn't see myself doing it. And that is being confident on camera. Yes, I couldn't. So let's talk. But before we start, have you already subscribed to my channel? No? So do it. You can see here, yeah, the red square. You, you can just click subscribe, okay? I will not start if you not do it. Have you done already? Okay, good. And at the end of this video, don't forget, just put a like. It will help the channel a lot. Okay, now we can talk. Self-motivating books. First of all, I prefer audiobooks because while I'm listening to the book, I can drive, I can cook, I can do my exercise, I can do my garden. So that's why I prefer audiobooks. For me, during years, I was listening to motivational and powerful books. And I can tell you, they helped me a lot because they pushed me out of my comfort zone. And I was convincing myself day by day that I could do this. Also, reading these kind of books opens you other doors to move forward with what you did desire. Talk with yourself. Talking to yourself can help you be more comfortable when you need to speak in public, make a social media live or record a video. You can do this in the shower, in the car, uh, in bed or even when we all, you are alone at home. What you need to do is choose a topic that you are comfortable with or you prefer to talk about it and just start. When you begin to listen yourself more and more times, you will get used to it and it will not be weird when arrives the moment to put you on our camera. One of my favorite exercises is speaking with a mirror. I look to myself, I speak, I laugh, I see all the expressions that I can do with my face and I like it. Petra, you can do it. You can do this. You have the power, you have the power, power to do this, okay? Today is your day. You will conquer the day. This day is special. Every day is special. It just depends on you. Find your own space. Well, for me, the only time that I find to record is in the kitchen. When I need to prepare dinner, I get my phone, I start a camera, I eat to record and I start to talk. And then it's funny to see me sometimes because I'm laughing what I did or said because my kids came and asked me a question or because I just made a funny face while I was recording. But that's okay. I can see how I stay naturally and the most important, being myself. You can always find time for this and the preparation of meals are not boring. Practice a lot. Like everything in life, if you practice many times something, it will be so easy when the moment arrives. Set your camera, and lights if you have natural light better and let's rock and roll just talk about the subject you like and look at the camera like to a friend of yours the point here is just to speak in a relaxed way after you watch the video and please don't be so harsh on yourself be gentle with yourself and see where you can improve for example when I was practicing I could see that I speak a lot with my hands as you can see during the video I guess but that's okay and I feel comfortable doing it have a plan and a teleprompter. I know many people say to do it without a teleprompter because it will stress you more or you cannot find an excellent way to work with a teleprompter. But in my case, I feel comfortable with that. Remove the pressure from memorizing lines and since I write my own script, I know what is there and then I just keep talking. And that works perfectly for me. Just because some experts say not to do it, I prefer this way because I feel more comfortable. You can try also with bullet points, but you just need to find the best way for you. You need to plan your videos in advance. So like that, you don't feel lost, you don't, you don't lose control, and then like that, you avoid to feel overwhelmed. For me, for example, I also have a blog, which one of my posts I turn into a video, so it's not a problem for me to write and also put on a teleprompter. And still, sometimes I improvise and say what comes to my mind, so I have extra info, so I don't follow 100% the teleprompter. And yes, you can still be natural with this little extra help. These are my main advice to be comfortable on camera and go there and smash it. But wait, I will give you another one that I do before the video, that is dancing. I listen to energetic music that makes me feel happy and free and I just dance. Life is beautiful. So with this, I will say bye. Okay, all right.